this is Tiffany aka Miss Beautiful and today I'll be showing you all how to wrap gifts like a pro. I would like to thank Miss Delbo. A couple years ago she called me and was like come help me wrap gifts for Christmas and I was like okay. Like I knew how to wrap gifts somewhat but for her just taking the time out to teach me some of her tips and tricks I will forever cherish her for that. So let's get into the video. Alright so of course you'll need your gift. And then we got some wrapping paper. This is just some really cute snowman-y Christmas tree paper. Of course, some scissors. I like to use a wire reef, and we're gonna use purple because these are really cute together. And last but not least, our tape dispenser. This thing is amazing. Like, so this really helps when you're wrapping gifts. So you won't have to keep picking up the tape dispenser and ripping off a piece. These are already pre-cut slices of tape. So it makes it a lot easier when wrapping gifts. And it fits around your hand. A nice elastic band. So you won't have to look for the tape every time you're getting ready for it. You can buy refills for them once they're gone. These are really nice. And no, this is not sponsored by Scotch, but if you're watching, you know. <laughs> Alright, let's get into it. So first, we're going to measure out some paper. So you'll always want to lay your gift face down because you'll be working on the bottom of the gift. And you don't want to hand somebody a gift <laughs> and they unwrap it and they see the bottom of the gift. So we're always going to face our gift face down and then we're going to measure our paper, make sure it's halfway. And then what I like to go ahead and do is take a piece of tape and secure that piece of paper. So we're going to just keep kind of tugging on the gift just to make sure that this paper is going to be nice and tight so we're gonna do it right there take our scissors and we'll see yeah, it should be good and we're gonna cut it now what i like to do before i secure this with tape is just pull this piece up Bring this a little closer to me so we won't have to cut so much excess paper off. Alright. Just making sure that. Alright, and we're just going to take a few places just to make sure it's once again secure. Then we're gonna take our other piece, make sure it's taut, not tight, but taut. <laughs> and take this piece, and this piece, and uh, there we go. All right, so now we have this here, and we're just gonna take the corners, and it'll kind of fall in place by itself, really. Doesn't matter what piece you put down first, but we're just gonna push it down like this. Take our tape, lay it across there. Then pull this piece up, make sure it's flat. And we're gonna secure this piece. Now what we're going to do is push our gift to the edge so it won't look so loose. And that seems pretty good. And now, here's for the estimating part. <laughs> you got to kind of guess how much you'll need for the top. So, it's always better to cut a little bit at a time. Because if you cut a lot the first time, you're going to end up having to wrap the whole gift again. And ain't nobody got time for that. Always make sure you, you save your reasonable amounts of wrapping paper because you can always use it for a smaller gift. All right, so we're at the top. I didn't cut enough off, but we're still gonna go with it, mistakes and all. 
So I'm just gonna tape this piece down and tape this down. All right, and then we're gonna pull this bottom piece up and that hides this over here. And like that. So this is the top of the gift. Isn't that nice? And this is the back. So this is why we put our gift face down. Because you don't want to hand somebody a gift like this. I mean, you could, but we're pros here, right? So here you go, all nice. And what I like to do to add my little personal touch, no one in my family does this. So they're like, oh, there's one of Tiffany's gifts because she has a wire reef, not wire reef, but she has some wire ribbon around it. <laughs> so, and I'm gonna make sure, kinda, kind of eyeball how much ribbon I'll need for this gift. <laughs> All right, and then we're just gonna tie it like we tie our shoes. And we're gonna get a little fancy. So we're gonna pull out the bow, make it all nice and fluffy. you can take your little tape dispenser off and what I like to do to the ends is just fold them and then we're gonna cut hope you guys can see this we're gonna cut from the unwired piece to the wire piece if that makes sense and we're just gonna cut a V into it okay and that'll have a nice little V shape It'll be really cute. And then we're gonna do the same to the other side, other piece. You could leave it like this, but I do have a couple ways you can make this special. So one trick I like to do is wrap this around my finger. And kind of pluff it out. <laughs> pluff it. You got yourself a cute little spiral bow. Or you can kind of fold it, kind of give it those folds. something like that there's a lot of things you can do as long as this ribbon does have wire in it if it doesn't have wire you won't be able to move it around like you want to you kind of scrunch it up that's what I like to do sometimes when I'm in a hurry <laughs> kind of do it like that kind of but my favorite is the first one that I showed you guys and that's my favorite one to do it's so cute and girly. All right, guys, that concludes my video on how to wrap gifts like a pro. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, see ya.